Hi everyone and welcome to Closet Conversations. I'm Gianna, your Closet Conversationalist. I put out videos on Mondays and Fridays. On Mondays we do Mommy Mondays. On Fridays we do Closet Conversations where we're leaning into luxury. So we talk about luxury, fashion, art, uh, jewelry, a little of this, a little of that, wherever the conversation leads us. Uh, I'm still working on my closet, although I don't really touch on it that much anymore because uh, I've not been getting very far. But um, yeah, I'm here today to talk to you about uh, a comparison video that I promised you a while back. If you like this video, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you think someone else would like it, please share it. If you uh, have been here more than once, you want to go ahead and subscribe by now. And uh, uh, is there anything else? If you don't like it, go ahead and comment down below. And if you want to join the conversation, please comment down below because I really like it as a conversation. I live close to the road, guys, so that will happen from time to time. But I like it as a conversation, not a monologue. So if you can go ahead and do so, just go ahead and comment and we'll chat. Sometimes you give me suggestions on videos and I can come. I have not forgotten the suggestions. I have them written down. It's just that I've been stealing time to like get these videos out lately because as you know, um, I'm now on Sunrise uh, on CVM. So I'm doing the round table. So it's like a lot going on and I do other projects and stuff all the time. So it's a lot going on. So I've not gotten to some of them. So I know like someone asked for a Louis Vuitton versus Coach one and I am the best person to do that because I used to work for Coach. I'm a very big fan of the brand, but I absolutely love Louis Vuitton as well. So I really, I will be honest with you on the two brands. Um, but in this moment, we're going to do two different brands. I promised a comparison video with the Louis Vuitton Felici and the Chanel Wallet on Chain. Now, I have two Chanel wallets on Wallet on Chains because uh, they're very different. So first of all, I'll compare and contrast those so you understand, so you don't think I'm a crazy person. So, by the way, Tanisha did my hair. I should have probably put up my video. Hold on, I can sit lower. <laughs> there we go. Um, so, okay. So the two, this one is lambskin. Ooh, ooh, Chanel, right? It was silver hardware. And this one is caviar with gold hardware. And uh, this one has the Mona Lisa pocket on the back. And this one does not. This one is a uh, quilted metalasse, I think they call it, or metalas. And this one is camellia, right? When you open, well, this one is an older version, so it has a snap closure. This one is a newer version, so it has a magnetic closure. Both of them have that zip pocket there, right? The chains that are attached, not detachable at all. Then the front pocket, right? And then inside, they look basically, they, yeah, they're the same. So it has the card slots in the slip pocket. One has money in it, one does not. <laughs> and the zip pocket there. They're the same. They're the same. They're just different looks so they can go with different things, right? So, that's those. And they're the same size, are they? Yes, exact same size. Wow. Yeah. So, there you go. The red might look a little taller. No. Nope. Well, kind of. But maybe how I'm holding it, too. I don't know. But they're the same. Then we've got the Felici. The Louis Vuitton Felici. So the Felici, I don't know where I put the chain right now because you know I'm always using it with other things. So, yeah, the chain is not in it. But that's the first difference we can already outline with the... I'll use one of these for ease, right? The first thing we can outline is, remember, this chain does not detach. So it's always there. It's pretty long, though. It's definitely longer than the Felici chain. The Felici chain, however, I can use it on multiple bags because it does detach. So there's two D-rings here. 
that can be tucked or can be out, right? I don't know if you can see, yeah, there we go. Right, so that's the first thing. The second thing, the second difference, hold on. Let's see the difference in size. They're about the same height. Wow, oh no, okay. I was gonna say, and the same width, but they're not. They are, this one's about an inch longer. Yeah, no more than an inch, about an inch longer. And, um, yeah, and they're about the same height. Yeah, they really are about the same height. Yeah. Right? So, again, the red one kind of looks a little up, but nothing can fit in that part. So, they're pretty much the same height for, for all intents and purposes, right? So, in here now, here's where they differ a lot. Inside the Felici, inside the Felici is just one pocket, and it's a textile lining for this one. Um, I think all of them have a textile lining, and this one is lined in its own leather, same lambskin, right? So that's where the luxury kind of, you feel the more luxury here. Although when I bought them, No, this one I bought more recently, so it wasn't around the same price, but the black one was around the same price as this one at the time. Um, that's not the case anymore. Chanel has had woo, price increases. So, um, but yeah, so you would have told the difference really in the quality because remember this is canvas and like a textile lining, like a twill fabric or something. And this is like a leather, the actual leather from outside. And then the caviar, same thing, the caviar inside and outside. Um, so that's the first chief difference. The second one is that you already have a pocket here. You have a pocket here. You have a zip pocket here. You have a slip pocket here. And you have an open pocket here. So this open pocket would most match, I guess, this open pocket. But then in here, it's just the one slip pocket which I guess would be equivalent to this one slip pocket, right? But then there's a zip pocket. But instead of it being in here, this gives you the versatility, the option of still having the zip pocket, but they do it with their inserts, right? So these come with the bag, and so you have the inserts. So this would be equivalent to the zip pocket that is here, right? So we have the open pocket, the slip pocket, the zip pocket, right? And then the card slots that are there, you seeing them? Right? There's another insert for the Felici that covers that. So you have the card pockets if you need them. So the versatility of the Felici is that if you don't need them, you leave them home. If not, um, if you need them, you use them. Here, they're always there. So now, this one has one, two, three, four, five, six of the credit card slots. So the Felici does a little bit better for you if you need them, because this one gives you eight. But then, that insert also has another slip pocket which let's see let's see let's see let's see if we can find it okay yes which is here so you have slip pocket zip pocket slip pocket open pocket card slots and here we're gonna go over it so you have let's go from in the bag eh? let's go from in the bag let's do it right so you have Slip pocket, zip pocket, slip pocket, and card slots. So you pretty much have the same amount. Now, the only other thing you'd have is the zip pocket here, and then here you have a stationary chain, like a chain, permanent chain, and this one you have a removable chain. Now, 
why is it that I feel though, not that I feel, in my experience, this one, the Chanel Walk, the wallet on chain, it actually fits more things than the Felici, even though you can take these out. So even if you take these out, um, the walk fits more. And I'm going to show you why right now. Let me just get these in here. You know, I'm a little, I'm a little nutty. Um, so I can't get them in. Okay, there we go. There we go, there we go. Okay, so the Chanel walk fits more for me because it has gussets here, guys. So when I put more things, it just opens out more, right? So when you do that, now let's compare with the Felici. Oh, oh, oh. Chanel kind of sealed the deal there. Look at that. It's like, a, let me see how much. It's a good amount more, right? Hope you're seeing that good. I don't know if I showed it well enough. Let me see. There. So you see, that's matching up there. And that's how much extra you have. Right? So you have a lot more space. And then how I do this is, oh, I should have taken my phone case and all that to show you. So I typically use this pocket for my phone because this doesn't have an outside one. But even if it has the outside one, it's not big enough for my phone. So here's the outside one here. It's not big enough for the phone. But both of them fit the phone fine right in here right in here and I have for for reference a Samsung Note 20 um, and it fits perfectly right there so my phone is covered inside my bag it fits also inside the Felici but once it fits in the Felici like you can get keys lip gloss and that's about it it's over here now I can put a compact if I want to and remember now I'm doing all this plus I have the card slots already in it Remember, to fit it in the Felici, the card slots and the, the zipper pouch have to come out. There is no putting both at the same time. No. So, I'd have the phone here. I'd do whatever I want in this part that expands, right? And I'd have my that stuff there. And then in here, i put some cash. Oh, see? There's cash there. Right? So, cash and whatever I need there any cards or anything I get there or hairpins or whatever um compact anything small all my cards and in here I put more money or anything that I might need you know that I don't want to be in the hullabaloo here anything flat right and this is a very versatile bag this is a very comfortable bag it's perfect for evening and red for me is a neutral as we all know I talk about this all the time and um, and the black you can't go wrong with the black walk so do I love the Felici though yes I do <laughs> yes I do I love the Felici um but would I want another one? I think we talked about this already and I said I can't justify getting another one even though some of the prints and limited editions they come out with are really amazing. I can't justify it because I really don't use it enough. Um, I use it if I want to have a look and I want something stylish, you know, but if it's like utilitarian and I'm going somewhere and I want to look classy and I need to bring my stuff, it's one of these because these are just easier to pack and easier to bring my things without having an issue um yeah so that's my comparison if you have any questions or i didn't cover something please let me know um but that's my quick comparison of the louis vuitton felici and the chanel wallet on chain um again i can show you them side by side they are I mean, these are, first of all, but these have gone up so much in price. I don't know if pre-loved is better to try to find them if you don't have one already. I'm glad that I've had mine for as long as I've had them because I'm not getting any more. 
because the expense is great. Although there was this green a few years ago and I got it in like a cast wallet and I wish I had gotten it in a walk. But I think the price had already jumped for the walk. So that's why I didn't get it. Um, but yeah, so these are the ones I have. Um, I do think you should have a Felici, but if I had a choice of only between a walk and a Felici, because of the fact that I need to pack more things sometimes, I would go with the walk. Um, and I do love the Felici. So if you have any questions, please leave them below. Comment, like, share, subscribe, turn on the bell so that you're notified when you get new videos, when I put up new videos and join me on CVM TV as well. Um, so we're rostered, so I can't tell you when I'm going to be on because I'm going to be on all the time. Um, and I just don't know which days and all of that. So tune in every day at 8 o'clock for the Sunrise Roundtable and check me out and let me know how I'm doing. Okay, thanks so much for joining, guys. Have a great week.